We're here with Jonathan Badia, a Harvard student. And uh, Jonathan, what are you doing here in Denver this week? I'm here with Denver. I'm here with the Young Democrats of America. We're the largest organization in the country representing young people. Non-federal 527. Our job is to go out there and make sure all the talk about young voters actually voting gets done. All right, and then uh, so you're in here as an honored guest, I see, in your press credential. What exactly does that mean? It means that I talked to somebody in the Puerto Rican delegation. He was a good friend of mine, and I got elected to the DNC this past weekend. I guess uh, getting somebody on the DNC helps. So what's the uh, most interesting thing you've seen so far here? I think, honestly, yesterday was kind of interesting. We had about 500 anarchists walking down the street, and I was at Chipotle getting a burrito. And we see a column of armed right police walking past. That was pretty interesting. But some of the speeches inside today, we, we just started watching, are really fascinating. We had a lot of members of the Congressional kind of caucus talk, a me member from my state, Jose Baca just spoke, great speech. And I think the speakers can only, are only gonna get better as the week progresses. And what would you say you're most looking forward to? I think in Vesco Field on Thursday, it's going to be an historic event. It's not here at the Pepsi Center. We're going to have thousands of people, 76,000 around. We've never had anything like that in American political history. And that's something that will be in the textbooks for many generations to come, I think. Right, thanks so much.